Ned Newley is the governor, but not by his own choosing. Ned was sworn in due to a salacious multi-level political scandal that resulted in the removal from office for each of his superiors, including the previous governor. Now, Ned is the governor, and now Ned's also up for re-election. Ned is not comfortable. If we want him to look like a governor, we put him in the governor's office. The problem for Ned is, He's terrified of public speaking. Any poll numbers about Ned are impressively awful, and he has no personal connection to the people he's actually supposed to represent. I'm not a sir, AC. I'm just, just a guy. The thing is, Ned's dedicated chief of staff knows he's the right man for the job and can turn this state around. But Ned's nervous fears could be his undoing. I am not putting him on television again. Okay, but you have to put him on television again. Then there's political guru Arthur Vance who sees it differently. There is only one thing for you now, one purpose, and its name is Ned Newley. Ned Newley may be one of the worst politicians ever sworn into office, and definitely the worst politician to ever run for re-election. Unless the public is looking for the worst and most inappropriate candidate to ever run for office. Ned Newley is The Outsider, a timely and hilarious comedy that skewers politics and celebrates democracy. Written by Paul Slade Smith, directed by Todd Mills, The Outsider, live on stage at the Barn Theater in Montville, New Jersey. Get your tickets now. Call 973-334-9320 or reserve your seats online at www.barntheater.org. That's barntheatry.org. Hurry, tickets are limited and your vote counts. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday matinees. The Outsider. Politics will never change unless...